the biggest I'm him moments in history by Ray. Shout out to you, my boy. There are certain moments when us as viewers are so awestruck that no words can right, describe right, the right. absolute masterclass of a performance. Yeah, we yeah, yeah. Missed. A lot of those in, in anime. Us is simply, he got that dog in him. He got that Thanks. dog in him. Now to provide mm -hmm. an example of one of these moments, I give you Kanye West in 2011. Oh, no. Now, I specify Kanye in 2011 so that I don't get chokeslammed by certain communities or it's Twitter before the craziness. It's a certain event that oh. happened last year. Because yeah. Kanye in 2011 was a whole different beast. What happened? Because he decided to commit the, the one uh, sin on stage. more unforgivable than anything he's done up until then. Oh, Beyonce. He made yeah. a fan base, mostly comprised of white women, upset. <laughs> now, I completely understand why people are uh, him. You know, what he did was mad disrespectful, it was. even if he was off the henny. But you also got to understand, he was standing up for my queen Beyonce. And, you know, <laughs> she was down was horrendous. Have y'all heard Love on Top on the radio in the car with your mom? That shit really gets me going. It really does. shake a little something as a grown man. I don't know no about that. No other song quite brings out my about that. tendencies like this one. I don't, I don't know about that. on me. I got I a little sidetracked. That was besides the point. Kanye in 2011 went to isolation after stealing the mic from Taylor Swift at the 2009 <laughs> VMAs and saying Beyonce should have won her award instead. This led to him getting canceled by damn near everyone, including the f***ing president, because Obama said this. The young lady seems like a perfectly nice person. She's getting her award. What's he doing? Damn. Why did he do that? He's a jack. <laughs> damn! Obama hit you know, him with the jacket! This makes a bit more sense now. Anyways, oh. you want to know what Kanye did in response oh. to all this controversy? He dropped what almost everyone unanimously agrees is his greatest album. And not Which only one? did he drop his best album, Dark he did it bragging that the most and having the most cockiness he's ever had. Taking shots at everyone, from South Park to SNL. He made everyone who appeared on his album drop the greatest verse of their careers, from Rick Rocks giving out prime Which video album was this? to Nicki Minaj straight spin on Monster. This album was one I guess, of his most guess, successful albums and set the bar for 2010's hip hop as a whole and was unprecedented since many thought he may never touch the mic again. I know all he could think during this outcome was, simply, I'm, I'm him. him. Facts. Oh Facts. God, it's so cool, it's almost like that's the title and topic of the video and I just said it. Now to stray away from music, <laughs> another moment that really gets me thinking about how straight up different someone has to be Bro, to pull it off. Gotta give us a fight. Napoleon. What? Napoleon now hear me out, before you click off this video, <laughs> Napoleon let him cook, let him cook. was a minor general. But he got so much street cred from his wins that he ended up becoming the f***ing emperor of France. Okay. Napoleon was given to a disadvantage in almost fight back, every fight back, fight back. fight he was in. And still somehow won. The only five times he lost, he was at a severe disadvantage. His all-time record is 38-5. And, and to put <laughs> Napoleon in NBA Damn. Show, he was the 2015-16 Golden State Warriors if they didn't have Curry for half the season. 38-5 in and wars is crazy. That's, crazy. <laughs> crazy. That's absurd. Crazy. <laughs> That's right. war. It's murder. <laughs> That's the like... all-time regular season wins record. <laughs> I don't know how I can put it into a better perspective about just how different he was. Man, it was now, winning honest, battles. <laughs> bro, it's look. Bro, a basketball game takes a couple you hours. Win Football game, battles. couple. A battle can you take days to months. Battles. <laughs> Thirty-eight in the. The fact that he lost five and still came back is crazy. That boy mm. is absurd. No, absurd. In case I did, here's a little photo. This dude took over half of the world in two decades. Damn! He's him. Damn! Now for this section, I'd like to dedicate it to fictional moments that aren't a part of human history, obviously, but still need to be mentioned. Yeah, of course. And for the first of, of these, I'd like for us to look at season one of Breaking Bad. Okay. Now, this is long before Greatest the show ever. I am the one who knocks version of Walter White. Mm -hmm. Y'all might be thinking of. No, 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 no. This is season one, just hopped on the streets version of Walter, who was no dealing with crazy cancer and didn't know how to sling meth. Now to set the scene for this, Jesse, Walter's accomplice, <laughs> got his <laughs> feet days prior by a maniac named Tuco. And when mm. I'm saying he got his feet, he got his rock laid the fuck Make, 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 make. He just went up to him and said, hey, Tuco, you think I deal some meth with you? He said, ah, oh, hell nah, he beat the out of him. He beat the brakes off. I thought Tuco was a menace. Took his tight, tight, pound, tight, pound. tight. <laughs> He was having a gay old time on him. Like, I'd, Whoa, I'd it looked like he was getting rammed. It was insane. Now, I might be overhyping it just a little bit, but it's all so that I can set the scene <laughs> for what Walter was about to do. Now, me personally, I thought Walter was going to go and Tuco to make him deal with him. But nah, Walter said, F all that. Walter straight up told him, He walked in his office, didn't he? Me. 
I don't care. You are not intimidated. Yeah. Then when Tuco tried to press him, he blew blew up that bit up. the whole crack house with a goddamn rock. Like obviously there's was more to it. Than, you know, he's like a chemist. Yeah, it, well, it was a it was a whatever exposed. I mean, boy, it was yeah, disguised hey. as a crack rock, that boy blew as a meth rock. Crack. That boy, he say, oh, you think you thought that? Okay, man. But in my eyes, he threw a rock on the floor. It just blew up the whole crack house. Thanks. This scene left me speechless and had me straight dumbfounded had his at respect. the levels of disrespect I just witnessed. This dude got his bag from Tuco and just walked out like nothing happened. Like the building wasn't on fire and just there were just papers <laughs> and concrete all over the street. Like he walked blew out. Blew that mother smithereens. I respect it. W. Now, sure you know what's crazy? What? It blew the windows out. Blue still you saw the fire. They should be death. And they was all in there to stand it. They should be dead. They should all be out of there. As you can tell from my profile picture that I like anime. And what mm. I want to talk about okay, now let's get to it. is Ichigo getting his main character staffs revoked. This dude Ichigo oh, oh. got a whole theme song. We've been hearing it the whole series. He has a Oh, whole you theme talking song about why he's stopped number it. Number one. Number one. That means he's supposed to be the best, right? Nah. The nah. author of Bleach decided he was gonna be number two just for this one moment. Because Aizen rolled up on the whole soul side. We, we thought this dude was in a blunt the whole time. No. Nope. Just for him to pull back the very end of the heart and have a character who we thought, you know, was like, he was on top of the world. He just beat the main antagonist of the arc. Yeah, we thought Ichigo was him. Mm -hmm. Nah. Nah. This dude, Aizen was That's him. why Dizzy liked him so he much. He stopped the whole theme song with one finger. He stopped a sword with his finger, and I've never seen oh, someone Oh, we did humble. see this before. So, yeah. He stopped who the video, Who and video and is this? CJ the Champ. CJ, yeah, yeah, he stopped the theme song. Aizen was him. He That's was correct. him. There's That's a crazy touch to put on a Okay, a now show. I can't include a list of I'm him moments as a basketball fan without talking about LeBron James. LeBron is. And you obviously Le know what I'm gonna talk no. about. No. Yeah, I wanna see an I'm him moment. Dear editor, put the, put the picture up right here. This is R. Kelly, locked oh. up. Oh, still giving concerts, selling out oh, shows, baby. Sold out. That's how him, baby. Hey, look. So, hey, I'm, I'm going. I'm going to the concert. Yeah, let's go, Ronald Weasley. Uh, Ronald Kelly Weasley, man. One comeback. Now I didn't know how big of a widespread disease being a dumb was until I heard Skip Bayless open his mouth. LeBron led his team in every major statistical category facts, on all-time efficiency facts. while playing exceptional defense. And we still had people saying LeBron was in the finals MVP. He took on the greatest team ever Elbow. assembled I'm besides saying. the team that he had to face next year with KD. The greatest regular season team of all time. That boy KD really <laughs> got that Alright, that's it, y'all. Hey, you just wanted to read, yes, bro. Done. KD, man. That's why I wrestle don't f with you, boy. You a hoe. Don't get how that boy's on the rest of it. There's a parade inside my city. No, no, it's not. That no. Boy, that boy, get him. no, it's not. Earlier this year, John Moran said, I'm fine in the West. Why the Lakers up 3 1 on the Grizzlies? Nah, why? Uh, why we over. Over. Devin, um, Dylan Brooks? Dylan Brooks. Dylan Brooks nah, said, I'm uh, poke bass. That boy said, uh. I'm expecting me an old me man. Me old. Now, I, now what? Now, look, this <laughs> game winning shot was on who? Trash, <laughs> boy. Hey, send it to Dylan Brooks. Hey, oh, a no, fat oh, man whoa, talk about whoa, you. Whoa. See? Oh, whoa, okay. All right. That's why you about to lose, Still, though. Okay. It's a parade inside my city, yeah? <laughs> okay. Yeah, boy. This you both. <laughs> we'll try to argue with you that Kyrie deserved that finals MVP over here. Hell no. Nah. LeBron was him. He, there's nothing more you could say. He was him. He was. Finally, Facts. the last time him moment I want to talk about is you. Who is it? Go what? out there and prosper. There's so oh, many yeah. people this beautiful thing. Thank you, you dog. Don't confine yourself to Thank one you. topic. You know what I'm saying? Because I was in the hospital last week. You feel me? Had a little complications. Breathing. Found out they had that dog in me. You know what I'm saying? I was like, he, he was in the hospital last week because the dildo was stuck up his ass. Oh, okay. Diamond okay. been taking him. <laughs> Him and Diamond be pegging these Diamond peg the hell out of them. You just gonna do me you like that? You wanna know why he don't be at the gym? Like that. Be diggity, diggity. Okay, all right, that's it, all right.